Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's topic is about six ways to be less anxious and more present. Now remember, like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell to receive all of my content. Leave a comment below to let me know how you feel about this segment. Your response is highly appreciated. Definition of present is existing or occurring now. And it's principle for us human beings to understand that we must be less anxious and more present in life. And it's principle for us human beings to know how to be less anxious and more present in life. And I have arranged six ways to be less anxious and more present in life. We sometimes think in the past or in the future, trying to correct or understand things in life, not allowing ourselves to properly address situations that may have happened or about to happen in our life but we must stay present and deal with life as it comes. Point one, check in with yourself often. Ask yourself, how are you feeling? To ground yourself in the now, away from the past and the future. It's principle for us human beings to check in with ourselves often, to keep ourselves grounded and in the present state of mind. It's principle. Number two, recognize the purpose of anxiety. This is an inherent inner thing that's inside of us that helps us to recognize danger. And when it's working properly the way we need it to work, it's fine. But when we don't need it, this is when it makes our mind go either in the past or in the future. And we don't need this. We need to stay present and use our anxiety when it's needed. Number two, worry, AKA, Anxiety is useless. It's unnecessary, harmful, and a waste of time wondering about situations that may have happened or about to happen in your life. The best way to deal with a situation is to problem solve. Number four, worrying is not problem solving. It's principle for us human beings to understand that problem solving occurs outside of the mind. In the real world, where the problems are. And what you must do in order to really problem solve correctly is to intentionally develop strategies to solve problems and develop coping skills in life. This is how you problem solve correctly without worrying. Number five, mindfulness increases our formation to the now. Pay attention to what you're doing now. Always be present. Whatever you're doing in life, stay present in that moment. This will increase your formation to the now and prevent you from being anxious and trying to figure out what the future gonna hold or what the past, what you can't correct. Increase your formation into the now. Stay mindful. Number six, focus on your senses to stay present. Your touch, taste, smell, hear, and see all of these senses 
will help you to stay present in the moment and to not be in the past or the future. What you're hearing, pay attention to what you're hearing closely. What you're tasting, pay attention to what you're tasting to taste the flavors and the, and the ingredients and your smell. Make sure you smell all of the smells and aromas that you smell. And when you hear, hear deeply, hear the slightest of sound. And when you see, see correctly and see what's in front of you right now. This is how you stay present in the moment and beat that anxiety. I'm gonna do a recap. Number one, check in with yourself often. Number two, recognize the purpose of anxiety. Number three, worry, AKA anxiety is useless. Number four, worrying is not problem solving. Number five, mindfulness increases our affirmation to the now. Number six, focus on your senses to stay present. It's principle for us human beings to understand that we must lessen our anxiety by being present in the moment and to be less anxious about things in life as well because we cannot control the future or the past. Only thing we can do is handle the present as it is. Like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell to receive all of my content. Leave a comment below to let me know how you feel about this segment. Your response is highly appreciated.